your daily three minutes devotional from the Jamaican New Testament. Welcome to Bread and Water. Our parabolic lesson comes from Matthew chapter 18, verse 23 to 35. May I tell you that? Cause at this God kingdom coming like, it's coming like one king. We did one check off how much all of him serve and them did owe him. When the king did their check off, then bring one man come we owe him how much, how much million. No, because the servant couldn't pay it back. The king ordered them to sell him and sell him a wife and him picnic too. Plus, all of him own, so he could have get back his money. The servant dropped on him knee in front of the king and begged him. Do, take time with me, sir. Give me some time and me will pay back everything. The king feels sorry for him and make him go on. And all when did owe, the king said him not to pay back nothing again. After him going now, this said servant, that's the one next servant, we owe him one little bit of money when you think about how much him did owe the king. The servant grabbed the nether one throat and start choking the daylight out of him. Him said, give me the money where you owe me. The nether one where I want servant just like him, drop on him knee and beg him, do take time with me. Give me some time and me will pay back all of me owe you. But him didn't take that. Him said no. And go and go fling the nether servant in a prison till him pay back everything. When other servant like him see what happened, then begs bad bad and go and go tell the king everything so the king called the first servant and said to him say you wicked servant you me pardon you how much how much million can you beg me you mean say you couldn't take pity upon the smuddy where a servant just like a you the same way all me take pity upon you. And the king get begs and give him to the prison guard them for them to torment him till him pay back every red cent where him did owe the king. I see him so my father in heaven, we do know. If we don't call up on a brother and sister them in our heart and not pardon them. Father God, Papa, if Fill we up with the bread of life and the living water. In the name of Jesus we pray. Amen. Jesus told this parable on the heels of Peter's question. How often should I forgive someone who sins against me? Seven times? To which Jesus said, Not seven times, but seventy times seven. Jesus used this parable to teach his disciples about forgiveness. His response to Peter meant that wrongs should not be counted and that forgiveness should be ongoing. And no for we are trouble with us sitting there when in forgiveness, you know. Cause it's not just a word, it's an action. Somehow we have up some people so long till we not even remember what we and them did fall out over. Jesus is imploring us to do as the master did in the parable. Forgive, show mercy. You know why? Because unforgiveness carries its own consequences. Consequences that we would be better off without. As we say in a Jamaica, no make your belly bust your heart. Don't hold on to anger or grudges. Forgiveness is essential for emotional well-being. 
Today was merely the surface of this parable. Join us tomorrow for more.